Hey guys, Lyra Lynx here, looking pretty trashy. Here with another story. Because I thought, why not? The first one was kind of fun to tell. I didn't get much response yet, but I thought it would still be entertaining. So today I wanted to talk about the time I almost passed out at a con. I was at Grand Rapids Comic Con October 20th through 22nd with my friends. Everything was going fine at first. We were having a lot of fun. I was cosplayed as Mirai from Beyond the Boundary, but I took off my wig and glasses because they were starting to get annoying, to be honest. And we just went into the game room. We started playing some Super Smash Bros. And I was having a good time. I was going back to my old days playing as Lucario, spamming Aura Sphere like the most annoying player in the world. Everyone's making jokes, yelling at each other. It's the usual thing. And I have sugar issues, so I need to make sure that I always have a certain amount that I'm eating right and everything. And I thought it was fine. I'd eaten breakfast and had snacks and things. It's not like I was starving myself or anything throughout the day. I was like 100% sure that I'd be fine. But then the match gets over, I lose. And I don't know what happened, but like immediately my hands just started violently shaking and I couldn't even hold on to the controller anymore. It dropped into my lap as I like lost control of my hands. And my boyfriend, Devil's Demon 71, happened to see it and he immediately knew what had happened. So his first instinct was to round everybody up and be like, hey, we need to go. And he asked me if I needed any help up, and it was at that point that I realized it wasn't just my hands that were out of control and shaking. My knees weren't going to cooperate with me either, and I was going to fall if I were walking on my own. So he put a hand under my shoulder, he helped support me and walk, and... We started walking with Omniverse Productions out of the game room. And I'm glad that Devil's Demon has such a calm personality, because I absolutely don't. And the way I could feel myself shaking and I felt like I had no control over myself, I was getting like hot and nervous, just so scared. I started to freak out a little bit. And he was trying to convince me to calm down. He assured me that he would figure it out, find me something to eat. And he walked me out to a bench and sat me down and happened to find a worker and asked him if he had anything that I could eat, like sugar related. And he had some trail mix. It was like M&Ms and nuts and raisins. And I don't really like nuts, so I didn't eat those, but I immediately gobbled up all of the M&Ms and a few of the raisins just to get me strong enough to keep walking back out to the car. And so again, he calmed me down because I was near tears because I was so afraid. I could feel it that I was just like losing control of everything. My mother has had similar experiences before. I believe that she has actually passed out, and I'd never gotten so close in my life. I was afraid that I was going to slip out of consciousness at any second. Whew. So he just helped calm me down. We started walking again. I still needed his help. I held his hand so tight as I was shaking and shaking. And I would stumble every now and then, and I was afraid that I was going to drop to the ground at several points, but he had me. And we made it back to the car. He had called his mother, and they knew what was happening with me. And we were all able to make it back out, and I ended up getting some more things to eat and all that. And I felt better. And I didn't end up passing out. It was really scary to have to walk through the entirety of the building out to the car. It felt like such a long walk. Especially considering that I thought for sure that I was not going to make it. And there were just all these people cosplayed walking by us that 
<laughs> seemed to be giving looks, didn't know what was going on, and, oh man, it just added to my anxiety over the whole situation. But I ended up being fine, and I went back for another day, and <laughs> made double sure that I'd be fine in terms of food. So now it's just a story I look back on, and I'm like, wow, I'm glad that I have a good boyfriend who knew what to do. And <laughs> I'm glad that I wouldn't have passed out, because that would have been terrible. I don't think I'd be allowed to go to cons anymore. <laughs> so I hope you enjoy my random story. And if you want to see more of this and other anime-related things, or pet videos, because I do that a lot too, then make sure to leave a like, subscribe to the channel, and you can tap the bell for notifications. I hope you have a great day or night, and I hope to see you in another video. Bye!